Disclaimer, this is an emergency alert system scenario. It is completely fictive. All images belong to their original owners. This may include valid or invalid emergency alert system tones. Do not play this over the air or in the form of radio waves, as this can cause a false activation of the emergency alert system and can cause mass and potentially widespread panic. The owner will not be held responsible for any issues caused. This has somewhat loud and possibly scary sounds and noises, as well as descriptions, that some people may find creepy. Viewer discretion is advised. You have been warned. Another day working at the Space Coast, nothing interesting so far. Wait a second. What on earth, boss? You need to see this. Alright, what is going on here? Jupiter is no longer following its orbital path. The reason why it is doing so is unknown. Let me see for myself. Oh, I see. Wait a second, it's also coming towards Earth. According to the simulation, it says it will come close enough to cause harm. Well then, inform the government immediately. Yes, sir. It's for you, Mr. President. Hello, who is this? This is the Kennedy Space Center with important news for the President. That would be me. What would this news be? The planet Jupiter is expected to pass by the Earth in the next few days. We expect there to be catastrophic damage to the planet as a result. Understood. Thank you. We will declare a national alert shortly. This is an emergency action notification requested by the White House. All EAS participants will follow activation procedures in the EAS operating handbook. For a national level emergency, the President of the United States, or his designated representative, will shortly deliver a message over the emergency alert system. Please stand by. Please stand by. Please stand by. We interrupt our programming. This is a global emergency. Important instructions and details will follow. This is an emergency action notification. All broadcast stations and cable systems shall transmit this EAN message. 
This station interrupted programming at the request of the White House to participate in the emergency alert system. During this emergency, most stations shall remain on the air to provide news and information to the public in assigned areas. This is WUSA. This station shall continue to provide news and official info to the Washington, D.C. area. If you are not in this local area, tune to stations providing news for your area. Do not use the telephone. Telephone lines should be used for emergency use only. The emergency alert system has been activated to keep you informed. We interrupt our programming at the request of the White House. This is the emergency alert system. All broadcast stations and cable systems shall transmit this CEAN message. This station interrupted programming at the request of the White House to participate in the emergency alert system. During this emergency, most stations shall remain on the air to provide news and information to the public in assigned areas. This is WUSA. This station shall continue to provide news and official info to the Washington, D.C. area. If you are not in this local area, tune to stations providing news for your area. Do not use the telephone. Telephone lines should be used for emergency use only. The emergency alert system has been activated to keep you informed. Ladies and gentlemen, a representative of the President of the United States. The following message has been given authorization for release at the request of the President, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, the United States Government, and the United Nations, effective starting at 6.10 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, which is also 5.10 a.m. Central Daylight Time, which also is 4.10 a.m. Mountain Daylight Time, and lastly 3.10 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time. This is not a test. I repeat, this is not a test. My fellow Americans, today and tomorrow are going to feel like the roughest days in history. A few moments ago, NASA detected that Jupiter is currently not orbiting the Sun. It is going to fall closer to the Sun, passing Earth along the way. Then, it will begin to orbit the Sun again. The disasters caused on Earth by this could nearly be civilization ending. Disasters that may occur include but are not limited to more earthquakes, more and stronger volcanic eruptions, more heat waves, tornadic activity, increased tropical cyclone ferocity. Meteor impacts both from Jupiter's gravity, Jupiter's moons, and Jupiter's rings. And there is also a chance that the gravity of Jupiter may seep into the Earth and cause parts of it to be sucked into Jupiter. Lastly, there is a chance that one of Jupiter's major moons may collide, but this is very unlikely. Chances are, this is not the end of the world. To repeat, this is not the end of the world. I urge everyone to remain calm. If you panic, the damage will be even worse. I urge everyone to prepare for the disasters that will ensue. It is best to make a disaster kit. This includes the following. Non-perishable food that will last you up to two weeks. Plenty of water for drinking, clothing, medical supplies. Extra batteries. A portable battery-powered or hand-crank radio, preferably NOAA brand. And lastly, money and insurance, so that you will be prepared afterward. This disaster will be one of the greatest in the history of mankind. But this won't destroy our country. In the aftermath, we will rise up from the ashes as an even greater country. We will be stronger than ever before. Good luck, and may God bless the United States of America. That was a message from a representative of the President. We will now return to the emergency alert system. This is an emergency action notification. All broadcast stations and cable systems shall transmit this EAN message. This station interrupted programming at the request of the White House to participate in the emergency alert system. During this emergency, most stations shall remain on the air to provide news and information to the public in assigned areas. This is WUSA. This station shall continue to provide news and official info to the Washington, D.C. area. If you are not in this local area, tune to stations providing news for your area. Do not use the telephone. Telephone lines should be used for emergency use only. The emergency alert system has been activated to keep you informed.
Civil Danger Warning for the United States. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Federal Emergency Management Agency. Citizens of the metropolitan areas of the United States, lock all of your doors immediately. It has been reported that rioters have been taking to the streets, who are looting and damaging property. It is believed that these rioters are doing this out of fear as they believe the world will end. This is due to the upcoming Jupiter passerby event. Police are currently trying to apprehend the rioters. For now, all residents are advised to shelter in place. To shelter in place, take the following actions. Close and lock all windows, doors and other entrances to your home. Turn off all lights, noise-making electronics and air conditioning units. If you have a fireplace, turn it off as well. Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of the building you are in. Do not participate in the riots. By participating in the riots, you are putting your life and others in danger. You could face injury, death or arrest. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more information on this situation. Civil Emergency Message The following message is transmitted at the request of the National Weather Service, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, and the Federal Emergency Management Agency. It has been reported that stronger-than-usual winds have been occurring across the globe. These winds are reported to be as strong as 30 miles per hour at times, as well as instances of 40, 50, 60 or even 70 miles per hour. The wind is also pointing in the direct that Jupiter is originating from. This event is caused by Jupiter tugging on the atmosphere, even from a great distance. All residents are advised to take the following actions. Secure outdoor items that might be blown around in the wind. Stay away from trees that may fall onto you. When driving, stay away from other vehicles and drive slowly. High-profile vehicles are susceptible to high winds and can easily be blown over. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more information on this developing situation. Coastal Flood Warning for New York City The National Weather Service has issued a coastal flood warning. 
which is in effect until further notice. Hazard, coastal flooding, source, law enforcement, impacts, damage to property may occur. Those right in the vicinity are advised to evacuate to higher ground. We have special report coming in right now. Jupiter is on its way. And we even have this photo that is on the screen that was taken by a police officer. I'm going to be honest. This is terrifying. Our generation never has dealt with a rogue planet passing by. Wait, we are getting an emergency alert. Stand by for this public information center statement. Public Information Center Statement The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States Government, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, and the National Aeronautics and Space Administration. It has been noted that the planet Jupiter is soon to approach Earth. Jupiter will come nearby in the next few hours. The disasters that will occur due to this will be extreme. As a result, all residents are advised to keep emergency supplies ready. This includes food, water, medical supplies a battery-powered or hand-crank radio, preferably NOAA brand, clothing, and any insurance that will be required. Ensure these supplies last you up to two weeks. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more info on this situation. Early Detection Earthquake Warning This is not a test. The following message is transmitted at the request of the U.S. Geological Survey. An earthquake with a preliminary magnitude of 8.4 has been detected 25 miles off the coast. The effects of this earthquake are expected to strike in the next two minutes. All residents receiving this alert should take the proper actions. If indoors, get under a sturdy piece of furniture, cover your head and hold on. If outdoors, stay away from anything that may fall upon you. It is also to be noted that earthquakes have secondary disasters. If you smell gas, evacuate the local area immediately. If a fire is spotted, evacuate the area properly and calmly. It is also possible that due to the location of this earthquake, a tsunami may occur. Be prepared in case a tsunami warning is issued. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more information on this situation. Tsunami warning. This is not a test. I repeat, this is not a test. The National Weather Service issued a tsunami warning for Santa Clara CA, Solano CA, San Mateo CA, San Francisco CA, and Napa CA until 6.31 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time. At 6.05 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time, National Weather Service Doppler radar indicated a tsunami 200 miles off the coast moving at 60 miles per hour or faster. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Hazard, confirmed tsunami, source, radar indication and Pacific Tsunami Warning Center. 
Impacts. This is a potential mass casualty situation. The total destruction of coastal property is likely. Inundation of areas farther inland is possible. For your protection, evacuate as far inland or uphill as possible. Getting to high ground, such as a high-rise building, is also a safe choice. If you do not evacuate as told, you are putting your life in extreme danger. It is possible you may face certain death. Do not attempt to gather children or other loved ones from facilities like schools or nursing homes. These facilities have their own procedures. Evacuate now. Do not wait. Evacuate now. Early Detection Earthquake Warning This is not a test. The following message is transmitted at the request of the U.S. Geological Survey. An earthquake with a preliminary magnitude of 6.8 has been detected one mile underground. The effects of this earthquake are expected to strike in the next minute. All residents receiving this alert should take the proper actions. If indoors, get under a sturdy piece of furniture, cover your head and hold on. If outdoors, stay away from anything that may fall upon you. It is also to be noted that earthquakes have secondary disasters. If you smell gas, evacuate the local area immediately. If a fire is spotted, evacuate the area properly and calmly. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more information on this situation. Event type is tidal wave, for the entirety of Nova Scotia, effective until 9.50 a.m. Eastern Time. The following message is transmitted at the request of Environment Canada, the Government of Canada and Nova Scotia, and NASA, effective starting immediately, at around 9.28 a.m. Eastern Time, a tidal wave was detected in the Atlantic. This tidal wave is the largest tidal wave ever recorded. The wave height is around 2,560 meters tall, making this tide equivalent to a mega tsunami. This wave was generated by the immense gravity of the planet Jupiter. All residents in Nova Scotia are urged to get to highest ground possible. This is an extremely dangerous and life-threatening situation and must be taken literally. By not evacuating, you are putting your life in extreme danger and you may die. Evacuate immediately. Do not delay. Evacuate immediately. Le type d'événement est un rat de marée pour l'ensemble de la nouvelle Écosse, en vigueur jusqu'à 9h50, heure de l'Est. Le message suivant est transmis à la demande d'Environnement Canada, le gouvernement du Canada et de la Nouvelle-Écosse, et la NASA, effectif à partir de maintenant, vers 9h28, heure de l'Est, un rat de marée a été détecté dans l'Atlantique. Ce rat de marée est le plus grand rat de marée jamais enregistré. La hauteur des vagues est d'environ 2,560 mètres de haut. Faire de cette marée l'équivalent d'un méga tsunami. Cette onde a été générée par l'immense gravité de la planète Jupiter. Tous les résidents de la Nouvelle-Écosse sont invités à se rendre au plus haut niveau possible. C'est une situation extrêmement dangereuse et potentiellement mortelle, et doit être pris au pied de la lettre. En évacuant pas, vous mettez votre vie en danger extrême et vous pourriez mourir. Évacuez immédiatement. Ne tardez pas, évacuez immédiatement.
This is an activation of the emergency broadcast system, activated by the British Broadcasting Company. The following message is broadcasted at the request of the British Parliament and the BBC. An earthquake warning has been issued for the area until further notice. An earthquake was detected three miles underneath the city of Manchester. This earthquake is rated magnitude 7.5 on the moment magnitude scale. The effects of this earthquake are expected to occur in the next few minutes. All residents are advised to duck and cover under a sturdy piece of furniture. Remember to protect your head. If you are outside, stay away from any objects that may fall on you. Take cover now. Do not wait. Take cover now. Eruption imminent. Eruption imminent. A volcanic eruption is imminent. This is not a test. The following message is transmitted at the request of the U.S. Geological Survey. The U.S. Geological Survey has detected a blob of magma shooting towards the surface. When this hits the surface, it will cause a massive explosion. This type of eruption is known as a kimberlite pipe eruption. This type of eruption has not occurred on Earth in 30 million years. When this occurs, the complete destruction of the surrounding area will be all but certain. Massive fires will break out and lava bombs will rain across the area. All residents are immediately advised to shelter in place. There is no time to do any proper precautions. Get into an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy. mandatory evacuation order. This is not a test. I repeat, this is not a test. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Minnesota State Government, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, and the National Aeronautics and Space Administration. All residents of the entire state of Minnesota are advised to evacuate immediately. The National Aeronautics and Space Administration detected a large meteor that will make impact later today. This meteor is large enough to wipe out the entire state. When evacuating, be sure to bring food, water, medical supplies, clothing, a portable hand crank or battery powered radio, a flashlight, extra batteries, and insurance information. When evacuating, ensure you follow evacuation routes. Listen to local civil authorities. Evacuation shelters are being set up outside of the state. Remember to tie a brightly colored towel or blanket to a visible part of your home. This tells authorities that you have obeyed the evacuation order. If you need assistance, let authorities or someone you know take you to the evacuation shelters. Evacuate now. Do not wait. Evacuate now. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more information on this dangerous situation.
civil danger for the United States. The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States government, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, and the Federal Emergency Management Agency. This is not a test. The strong magnetic field of Jupiter is producing life-threatening radiation levels. This radiation has already claimed the lives of hundreds around the world. It is expected that the high radiation levels will persist until Jupiter goes farther than two lunar distances. For your safety, take these actions. Remain indoors, away from windows. It is also advised to close and block all windows using curtains, blinds, or blankets. When going outside, wear as much clothing as possible. The same is applied for when in a car. If you have been exposed to the dangerous radiation, take a shower as soon as possible. This will get rid of some of the radioactivity. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more information on this dangerous situation. High wind warning in effect until further notice. The National Weather Service issued a high wind warning for United States. Effective until further notice. What? Winds in excess of 80 miles per hour, with gusts reaching up to 100. Where? The entirety of the United States. When? Until further notice. Impacts. Unsecured outdoor objects will be blown around. Damage to roofs is possible. Trees may be damaged or even blown down. High profile vehicles will be blown over. Mobile homes may be damaged or destroyed as well. Blowing dust may reduce visibility. For your protection, stay indoors in an interior room. Driving is extremely dangerous in these conditions and is not recommended. If in a mobile home, quickly move to a substantial shelter that will offer you protection. Tsunami warning. This is not a test. I repeat, this is not a test. The National Weather Service issued a tsunami warning for West Coast of Florida, Coast of Louisiana, Coast of Mississippi, Coast of Texas, and Puerto Rico until 10.44 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 10.19 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, National Weather Service Doppler radar indicated a tsunami in the center of the Gulf of Mexico. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Hazard, confirmed tsunami, source, radar indication, impacts, this is a potential mass casualty situation, the total destruction of coastal property is likely, inundation of areas farther inland is possible, for your protection, move as far inland and uphill as possible, getting to high ground, such as a high rise building, is also a safe choice, if you do not evacuate as told, you are putting your life in extreme danger, it is possible you may face certain death. Do not attempt to gather children or other loved ones from facilities like schools or nursing homes. These facilities have their own procedures. Evacuate now. Do not wait. Evacuate now.
excessive heat warning in effect until tonight at midnight. What? Temperatures in excess of 120 degrees have been reported throughout the country. Where? United States. When? Until tonight at midnight. Impacts. Intense heat will be dangerous to young, elderly and ill. To protect your life, take frequent breaks when working outdoors. Drink plenty of water. If possible, postpone times of strenuous activity to early morning or evening hours. Do not leave young children or animals in cars. Cars can heat up very quickly to potentially lethal levels. Look before you lock. Know the signs and symptoms of heat stroke and heat exhaustion. If someone has these symptoms, dial 911 and rush them to the hospital. Mandatory evacuation order. This is not a test. I repeat, this is not a test. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Moore Police Department, the Moore Fire Department, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, and the National Weather Service. All residents in Moore are encouraged to evacuate the city immediately. Two tanker trucks had a head-on collision. Both exploded instantly due to temperatures reaching 140 degrees. After this, a massive fire erupted on the highway. The fire is expanding rapidly in all directions. All residents are advised to immediately leave. Do not grab any supplies. Do not pick up relatives from schools or nursing homes. These facilities have their own procedures. This is an extremely dangerous and life-threatening situation and should be taken seriously. Evacuate now. Do not wait. Evacuate now. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more info on this dangerous situation. The National Weather Service issued Tornado Watch Number 207 for the following areas State of Kansas, State of Oklahoma, State of Nebraska, State of Missouri, State of Arkansas, and State of Colorado, which is in effect until tonight at midnight. Remember, a tornado watch means that conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including tornadoes, large hail, and damaging winds. The National Weather Service issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Grand OK, K OK, Garfield OK, and Noble OK until 10.38 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 10.18 a.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located Kingfisher County, moving northwest at 40 miles per hour. Hazard, golf ball-sized hail and 70 miles per hour winds, source, radar indication. Impacts, damage to roofs trees and cars as possible. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Flooding may be likely with this system. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roadways.
the National Weather Service issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Douglas KS, Osage KS, Franklin KS, Miami KS, Anderson KS, and Lynn KS until 11.23 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 10.18 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Kingfisher County in Oklahoma, moving northeast at 40 miles per hour. Hazard, tennis ball-sized hail and 80 miles per hour winds, source, radar indication, impacts, damage to roofs, trees and cars as possible. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Flooding may be likely with this system. Turn around. Don't drown when encountering flooded roadways. The National Weather Service issued a tornado warning for Franklin KS until 11.12 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 11.04 a.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Franklin KS. Hazard, confirmed tornado. Source, train storm spotters. Impacts, damage to homes, cars and buildings may occur. Mobile homes may be destroyed. For your protection, take cover now. Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If outside or in a mobile home, find the nearest substantial shelter. Take cover now. Do not wait. Take cover now. Tornado emergency. This is not a test. The National Weather Service issued a tornado warning for Johnson KS, Wyandotte KS, Plate Mo, Clay Mo, and Jackson Mo until 11.34 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 11.04 a.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Franklin KS. This is a life-threatening situation. Hazard, deadly tornado. Source, Storm spotters and law enforcement. Impacts. This is a potential mass casualty situation. Damage to buildings is likely and complete destruction is possible. Mobile homes will be completely obliterated. For your protection, take cover now. Seek an underground shelter. However, safety under these shelters cannot be guaranteed. The ground has sometimes been scoured so badly that basements have been destroyed. Safe rooms have also been severely damaged. By not seeking an underground shelter, there is a high chance that you will die. Take cover now. Do not wait. Take cover now. This is an emergency situation. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Columbus Police Department.
an unusual situation is occurring in the city of Columbus. Multiple small objects, small animals, and a few people have been reported missing. These objects have, quote, disappeared from the face of the planet. It is unknown what is causing this, but it is possible this is linked to the Jupiter situation. All residents are advised to remain vigilant for strange activity. Stay tuned to news media outlets for more info on this developing situation. Catastrophic danger for the state of Ohio. This is not a test. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Ohio State Police, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, and the Ohio Emergency Management. An extremely dangerous situation is unfolding in the state of Ohio. Winds in excess of 200 miles per hour at times is being reported locally in Ohio. These winds are moving straight towards Jupiter. These winds are expected to reach at least 600 miles per hour. In addition, earthquakes in excess of magnitude 4 are occurring throughout Ohio. It is expected that buildings, cars, roads, and anything else will be sucked towards Jupiter. This also is the reason behind the disappearances in Columbus earlier. For the safety of all residents, get into an underground shelter immediately. Do not go outside until the winds calm down below life-threatening levels. Do not wait this out in any above-ground structure. Doing so may result in certain death. Due to the nature of this crisis, television stations will go off the air for the time being. Repeating, get into an underground shelter immediately. This is an extremely dangerous and life-threatening situation. All clear for citizens of the United States. I repeat, all clear for citizens of the United States. The threats that Jupiter posed to the world have ended. However, many injuries and fatalities have been reported. Many people are missing. Countless structures have been damaged or destroyed. Some coastlines have been changed due to wave erosion. Many power outages also have occurred. And some cities and roads were completely wiped off the map. If your home was destroyed, dial 911 and the military will take you to a military base. There you will stay until your home is repaired. Repeating, the threats that Jupiter posed to the world have ended. However, many injuries and fatalities have been reported. Many people are missing. Countless structures have been damaged or destroyed. Some coastlines have been changed due to wave erosion. Many power outages also have occurred. And some cities and roads were completely wiped off the map. If your home was destroyed, dial 911 and the military will take you to a military base. There you will stay until your home is repaired. There however is other news as well. Jupiter's moons Europa, Thebe, Aede, and Amalthea are now orbiting the Earth. The night sky will be brighter than usual when Europa is visible with the full moon. And tides have a chance to be more extreme. However, this is something that can be easily survived. We will rebuild. Warnings will be handed over to local and state authorities. Your government thanks you for your cooperation during this emergency. Programming will try to recontinue.
Thank you.